Hi everyone, and welcome back to the KHS Weekly Show. Alongside Evan Lane, I'm Jason Rienzo, and thanks for joining us. Evan. Shout out to Miranda Byrne and Rebecca Gomez for that intro video. Our show this week is for December 10th through the 14th. Okay, we have several announcements for, for this week. And later in the show, we have a video segment about student athletes that have signed their national letter of intent to play NCAA Division I athletics. Getting started, we'll be right back after this short message. Reminder, holiday grams will be sold through December 12th. You can buy candy canes and chocolate gelts for a dollar. And new this year, holiday singing telegrams for $10 all come with a message. They will be delivered by Santa and helpers during Block C on December 20th. Also, reminder, Ugly Sweater Day is December 20th. Up next are a few, few school news and informational announcements about things happening at KHS. Hey, big shout out to the Kinlon High School Student of the Week, Katherine Brown. Awesome. Congrats. Catherine. Moving along. A special thanks is extended to those who donated to the Tri-M Music Honor Society Holiday Toys for Tots Drive. Your generosity is appreciated. Our next announcement honors Coach Dr. Steve Racine. Doc was recently honored by the MCGSCA for his outstanding career as a soccer coach. His accomplishments include 593 career wins, which is the fifth most all-time wins in high school girls soccer. Congratulations, Coach Racine. Up next are a few school activity and club announcements. Please listen carefully. Attention all, the auditions for the KHS Spring Musical, The Susicle, will take place Tuesday, December 11th from 3 to 5 p.m. in the KHS Auditorium. Callbacks will be Thursday the 13th and Friday the 14th from 3 to 5 p.m. There are many roles and the show is very fun. We encourage you to come out and try it. Any questions, please contact Ms. Sapio via email or stop by room 302. For more info, including the Google Classroom for the Spring Musical, check the flyers in the hallway. Hey Evan, want to know how you can give back this holiday season? Or did you know about the cre creatures that have invaded the Kinlon Public li Library? <laughs> and know why this past midterm elections were historic for Morris County? Well, Evan, if, you answer to these, if your answer to, to these questions were no, then go check out coltchronicle.org. It's the place for KHS news. Attention all, the KHS GSA Club will have its first meeting Thursday, December 13th during lunch in room 211. Up next, sports announcements. Earlier in the fall, several student athletes signed their, their national letter of intent to play NCAA Division I athletics. Including schools in the Ivy League, SEC, CUSA, the Big East, the Missouri Valley Conference, and the Northeast 10. Along with my co-host Evan Lane, producer Mitch Polavoy provide this report. We'll be right back. Hi, I'm Evan Lane here at the 2018 Athletic Signing Ceremony. Let's check it out. Where are you going to school and why did you make your choice? Um, I'll be attending the University of South Carolina to further my um, equestrian and academic career. Um, I picked South Carolina because it felt like home to me and I really could picture myself there for the next four years. I'm really excited to be going to Illinois State. Um, it's a dream come true for me to finally be going to Division I. I'm going to Old Dominion University and I made the choice because I fell in love with like the campus and the team and the coaches were always just like super supportive and I can't wait. <laughs> I'm going to University of New Haven in the fall and I just really liked all the programs they had, especially the lacrosse team. They're so nice and inviting. and I just love it there. I'm going to Brown University. Um, I made this choice because it's a really good academic and athletic school, um, so it's not just like too focused on one um, over the other. I chose St. John's University because it has a great business program. It's in the city, so they have like a lot of connections there. Um, I like going to Madison Square Garden for like big like sporting games. Um, 
like Broadway shows, everything about the city is like awesome. Today is a special day and is a culmination of a lot of hard work for the student athletes, family and community. Describe what the day means for all involved. I couldn't have said it better myself. Um, listen, it's, it's so much hard work, it's so much commitment, it's so much time. Um, it means a lot to them, but it also means a lot to our community. Uh, these kids, these student athletes, they represent all the good that we have to offer from Kennelon High School. Again, things like commitment, leadership, being role models, all the things that every parent wants from their kids and every athletic director wants from their student athletes. Uh, this day is, is an important day because it's a celebration of success. You know, and I think sometimes we get caught up in the day-to-day -day moments of practice, uh, even victories sometimes we don't celebrate to the enough degree. And this is a cool day because it's a day to be with family and friends and to celebrate accomplishments, you know, which is the ultimate thing that you want to do with a goal. When you reach that goal, there should be some type of reward, and that's cool. Thanks to Mr. Rosenberg and all the athletes and families, and congrats to our own crew member Miranda Byrne and crew members Miranda Byrne and Nina Columbia on their accomplishments, and good luck. Shout out to the KHS girls swimming with their victory over Morris Hills. Good luck to both the boys and girls in your next meet. Good luck to our winter teams as many start their regular seasons this week. For all things KHS sports, scores, and updates, continue to follow KHS Athletics on Twitter at KHS underscore sports. Stay updated on all things KHS by visiting the school and district websites. Subscribing to the KHS social media accounts. And for future stories, news segments, and for future stories, news and segments, be sure to check out coltchronicle.org or our or our KHS YouTube channel. Our director today was Rebecca Gomez. Our technical director was Miranda Byrne. Our video producer was Pierce Alexander Harris. Our audio operator was Damien DiToronto. Our script supervisor was Mitchell Polavoy. That's it for today. Have a fantastic week. Continue to work hard, be kind, peace everyone.